So welcome to this short podcast tonight. Again, this is Bob McMahon at Campus IACFB. And what we're going to talk about tonight is we're going to talk a little bit about how our factors and our lenders can add their uh, their listing to the Directory of American Factors and Lenders. So here we are at Campus IACFB, that's IACFB.academy. And from the menu up here, we're going to go over to links. And we're going to go to the IACFB lenders directories right here. And here we are at the directories. And what we're going to be doing tonight is showing you how to do the standard listing. Now, when you come to the directories, of course, when you're looking for a factor or a lender or a broker, this is the primary search bar right here. And it defaults to commercial factors when you come here initially. But you can go to asset-based lenders, alternative commercial lenders, equipment leasing companies, and of course, brokers and consultants right here. But tonight we're talking about the commercial factors. So let's go take a look at what we're creating here. Let's go to the commercial factors. We'll do a search right here. And these are what we call the cards. These are just cards, a very brief synopsis of what this particular factor does, what type of programs they've got and so on. So we can go to a, uh, oh, go take a look at one of these. Oh, AR funding, let's go take a look at AR funding. And here is a very basic listing. This is not a not an expanded listing. This is a basic listing for that company. It's going to give a, a link to their website. It's going to take uh, give you some description about the company and so on. Gives you some in details about uh, for brokers and so on. So this is what we're going to create. We're going to create this listing. So let's go back to our home. And we're going to go up here in menu and say, add a listing. So we're going to create a listing. Now here you can, you have a choice of the, the type of listing that you're going to create factors, asset-based lenders, alternative commercial finance, brokers, equipment leasing. We're going to create a sample tonight with a commercial factor. So this gives you your listing form that we're going to fill out. So we're going to do a very simple form. Now here, when you get to the form, it's important to realize that there's everything is on this form, whether you are just creating the standard listing, which is free, of course, or are you going to create a member listing, which is a, a listing that's uh, it has expanded capabilities. So right here on all of the entries, you can see, is this a standard listing entry or is this a member listing entry? So we're just going to go over the standard listings for this tonight. So we're going to create a quick listing. I'm going to create um, IACFB factors, we'll say. Okay, now here, the next, the very first thing, which is a standard lease listing component, is it's going to ask you the description of your company. Now, I just grab some text here. I'm going to copy it and put it in. But here you would want to take some time. We give you up to 1,500 characters. So you can do quite a bit with 1500 characters as far as describing your company. So you're describing the company to brokers that would like to work with you and refer business to you. But also you're going to see some business owners that take a look at this uh, lenders directories because we do market with this. So you're going to see uh, companies that are looking for factoring and this kind of finance that will be uh, be looking at your description. So you want to sp spend a little bit of time here uh, being a, a little bit uh, detailed about what your company does, okay? So again, that's a standard listing component. Next is business assets finance. Now some uh, business owners and some brokers basically really don't know what factoring is. So they say, if I'm going to go to a factor, what, what are they going to give me? Are they going to give me a loan or what are they, what are they doing? Well, in components, 
the business assets that are that are financed for uh, for most factors are accounts receivable. But there are some factors that do other things. For example, if you do purchase orders, you might want to add that in there. So those are the business assets financed by our if uh, a fictitious company right now of IACFB uh, factors. And again, that was a standard listing. The next thing, transaction types, standard listing. Well, we do accounts receivable factoring, advanced factoring, I should say. And uh, we do, um, oh, non-recourse factoring for our company. And we do also recourse factoring. Okay. The next item is a member of listings. Again, now this is a little bit related. Uh, if we are a an ICFB member, we have some other features that we can add to that, like dip deals and credit insurance and so on. But these are special things that you do as a as a factor. So we're going to pass that by for right now. Preferred industries. Um, for some factors, this isn't important. For, for other factors, it's very important. This is a member listing component. So you have to be an ICFB member to put this. But basically, this is a, a additional service uh, type or, or preferred industries that we uh, commonly finance. You put in your standard uh, like staffing companies, janitorial services, manufacturing companies. And if we take a look at that, We have hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of companies that if you are a factor, this is a kind of a company that you very commonly finance and you can put in up to 25 of these. Now, where this comes into play is if you have a business owner or if you have a broker that has a, a client and that client happens to be a, a janitorial service, we'll say, well, the broker might want to find a, a factor that is very commonly a finance company for janitorial services. Well, this is where this comes in. Because if a, if you're looking for a factor that does do janitorial services, you can pull up all of the factors that have this as a listing. So it is, it is important. For some factors, it's very important. For some other factors, say, look, we do everything, so we don't really need that. Okay, but that's that's really that's the importance of it. The next item again is a, a members listing. This is companies that you will not finance. So, for example, if you're a factor but you don't do construction, or if you're a factor and you don't do freight bill factoring, or if you're a factor you don't do third party medical, something like that. Well, you're going to put this in so that if the if somebody is coming to you and wanting to get their invoices, their invoices factored for a doctor and it's all insurance claims, you don't do that. So you, we have fat, we do have factors that do do that, but most factors simply don't. So you're gonna add those items as, as the will not finance category. Uh, the next thing under standard listings, however, is your minimum client size. You wanna put in your minimum client and say, well, we'll do, we'll do clients as small as 10,000 a month, and the next item is your maximum client size. Well, we'll go up to uh, $2 million a month in receivables. Okay. The next thing is our standard listing is our primary location. Uh, we are in Florida. We are at 11,000 Metro Parkway. Fort Myers, Florida, right here. That's us. And that gives us the map. Now, if you are a larger factor and you have more offices, this is in the men member listing, we give you the ability to add as many offices as you have. It gives you one area for your primary location. But if you have other offices or you have BDOs that operate in particular cities, you can add all that in for in this information right here. The next item that is a standard listing is your website. So we're going to say our website is uh, HTTP IACFB.com. 
That's our wholesale area. Uh, the next thing would be your logo, logo image. Uh, this is a standard item, and this would be the, the company logo. Now, if we have already put in a listing for you, we have probably scraped your logo right off of your website. So we probably already have a logo in there for you. Okay. Uh, the next thing for standard listing is your phone number. And the next thing is your broker details. Um, here we say we do, we pay for referrals. Uh, we, we don't uh, actually put anything in the broker details about as uh, what we pay for um, commissions. We just say we do pay, pay uh, for referrals or we have st standard commissions something like standard industry commissions. But then we also have commission C, our company showcase below, which we'll talk about in a minute. So we'll say, uh, but but other than that, it's pay for, pay for referrals. If you have a training program, if you have any kind of a training program, you would, that would go in here. We obviously put a, have a training program. So we'll, we'll add that in. The next thing is your social networks. Uh, these are again are optional, but the standard listing. If you are part, if you are on LinkedIn or Facebook or Twitter or whatever, you're going to enter these items right here. For example, we would be on LinkedIn. Let's go here real quick to LinkedIn. So here is our LinkedIn. Just place paste the URL right there, paste it in. Okay. And uh, so that's a standard listing. And the next thing is uh, for members only. This is gallery images. Now we give you a, we give you three images. If you want to, if you're a factor, you're a lender, and you want to have some images of your company, your building any of the staff, whatever, those will go in here. If you have, want three uh, three images of potential clients, uh, if, you're, uh, uh, if you do a lot of uh, freight bill factoring, you do trucking, well, you might want to have an image of that on here. If you do staffing, you might have an image of that. So we give you three images here. It kind of, uh, kind of spruces up your list listing to some extent. And the very last thing here, again, this is a member's area. This is your uh, company showcase. And uh, a company showcase is a, is a, a very ex extended, uh, expansive listing, and it's for brokers. And we create these company showcases over at the IACFB magazine. Uh, and it's something we'll, we'll talk a little bit more about that later in some other um, YouTubes. But if you have a company showcase, or if you're coming into uh, your listing and say, well, I, I want to become a member. I want to become a member because I want some of this other stuff on this listing. Then we'll show you how to do this company showcase. And it's, it's, a, it's a good idea if you're going, uh, if you're doing this specifically to get at all of the brokers and have brokers take a look at you as a financing source then company listings are very large listings over at the over at the magazine. But again, we'll talk about that in, in subsequent uh, listings. Okay. So once this is done, then all you have to do is go, if you want to take a look at it, you can preview it right here. But we're going to go ahead and submit this listing. And it says the listing submitted successfully. Your listing will be visible once approved. And basically what happens is we check this every morning, sometimes more than once in a morning. And uh, if you're, we have a listing in there, we'll take a look at it, make sure it's correct and so on. And then we literally click the button that says uh, activate. And you now have a listing on the directory of American factors and lenders. If we have a an existing le, uh, directory le, uh, directory form for you, a listing already, 
and you come in and you create a new listing, basically what happens is we take a look at the existing listing and we deactivate it. And then we take a look at your listing and we activate it. And now you have your, your latest information on your listing. Okay. So that's basically how we do that. And you will end up with a, with a nice listing on the directory of American factors and lenders. And I think for the evening, I'm going to let you go for this evening. And we'll uh, take a look at our, uh, our YouTube videos because we have more instructions on the, we have a complete playlist now at YouTube just on the uh, directory of American factors and lenders. Okay. And other than that, I think we'll let you go for tonight. Thank you. Bye-bye.